Well, it's been a while since I was last out, but today I've taken the opportunity to have a walk. Uh, I've been dropped off at Hatchet Pond and I'm walking over to Longslade Bottom and Horseshoe. Um, don't know the route I'm taking. Uh, hopefully I'm going to take some nice pictures, short videos and show you the joy of the new forest at this time of year. It's in June and uh, I'm walking within the current restrictions that we are allowed to walk within. Mostly this won't be talking, mostly this will be pictures and short videos. I hope you enjoy. These days you have to use a stick to open gates to avoid the virus. But we're just entering the enclosure that's called Frame Wood, walking up what's called Moon Mon Mon Hill. There we go. Uh, hopefully, going to see some deer. Good deer hunting country. So lovely and peaceful, just inside here, at the top of Mo Moon Hill, we're in it wrong right there. Lots of foxgloves about, which the bees are absolutely loving. A few of these on the new forest used for the roundup of the, the ponies in the autumn. Let me check on their health and thin them out a bit. One of my favourite old woods, this one. Come here often with the dogs. It's just lovely, I don't spoil it. This clearing has been created in the wood by the two massive oaks that have fallen. All the trees nibbled at horse height. It's a wonderful view through the forest there. But I haven't seen any deer today. It's very true that the new forest landscape changes. What a little. This is down near Puddles Bridge, just outside of Brockenhurst.
Well, the weather has deteriorated. I hope you've enjoyed this walk through the new forest. Uh, I'm just in the woods above Longslade Bottom, um, just waiting for my wife and the corgis to arrive. Uh, I'll have a short walk with them and then get a lift home. In the meantime, I think I might actually uh, crawl inside this little house, which uh, has been built. Don't know if it's waterproof, but... I hope you've enjoyed it, and until next time, hopefully it won't be so long.